So when cooking with beef, which cut do you use? So let me talk to you about some of the cuts that I prefer when making a nice, for instance, a beef vindaloo. So I have three cuts of beef here. There's a beef fillet, which is very lean, hardly any marbling. A strip loin, nice marbling, great flavor. And the ribeye, which is my favorite cut of meat. Great marbling. And so now I want to show you how to trim up a ribeye if you're using it to make, say, a beef vindaloo. So you have this big piece of fat in here. We probably want to get rid of that. So we're going to follow the seam and we're going to open it up and trim it out. So you can see where the seam is and I'm going to use uh, a boning knife here and just follow that with little cuts. So I'm going to open it up all the way until I get to that fat and I want to trim it out. So there's the fat right there and you don't have to do it in one go. You can just do little cuts until you cut out that fat. And I'm going to keep going, keep going. Take this piece away. So this is the ribeye cut. This is actually my most favorite cut of meat that I like to barbecue with and, and cook with. For instance, we made this terrific beef vindaloo using it. So I've cut out that big piece of fat here. And then the other thing I want to do is I want to take this sinew out as well. So I'm going to put my knife underneath it one way and then the other way and cut this sinew away. Just pushing the knife up against the sinew. It's quite, it's quite tough. So your knife most likely will not go through the sinew. So we've got the sinew gone from this side. Flip it over and do the same. Fabulous cut of meat. Now, if we were cutting steaks, for instance, and marinating them, what you would do here is just trim the sinew off the top. And because the grain of the meat is running this way, you always want to cut your steaks against the grain. So this way. And whenever you're marinating, you want to use a glass bowl. You don't want to use a metal bowl because sometimes the acids that are in your marinade react with the metal. So always use a glass bowl for marinating. So with the fillet, I would cut this and make steaks out of it, or you can roast it. Same with the strip loin, cut steaks or roast it. And my favorite, the ribeye. Cut it into cubes to make a delicious beef vindaloo. And here I have a lovely beef ribeye with vindaloo sauce, butternut squash, and cauliflower. And that's how we mix in a little India. Namaste.